Craigslist price is right, and since he was uh, complaining the loudest, I'm going to give Greg the next one. Yes! Oh, Don't reward weak. him for his bad behavior. <laughs> Normal behavior. What's good, everybody? I'm Woody. That's Ravy. Hey, yo. Uh, Greg Gore, good Hi. morning to you. Good morning. Menace. What up? Uh, Seabass on set still of mm-hmm. his uh, movie that he's working on. But uh, we're checking in with him periodically. Nice. Mm-hmm. Uh, there is Bort. We got Caroline. Morgan's here. Vaughn's here. Phones are open. 877 44 Woody. That's 877 44 Woody. We're going to play the Craigslist Price is Right this right. hour. Uh, because everybody likes games and everybody yeah. likes a chance to win something. Right. So we're going to do the Craigslist Price is Right this hour. Uh, Greg, what was that thing that you were... I sent you the audio. Yeah, I got the audio. I, but I... I, I um, Because I got sent this video. Right. Greg's loving that, this video. I, it, it gives me a weird sense of joy because because <laughs> <laughs> I was kind of that guy that did stuff in, in my college years that I wasn't really aware of. You know, like you think it's a cause and you're going to jump behind a cause without even knowing about the cause that you're talking about. Yeah. Is it kind of like the people that are wearing like the Che Guevara? Yes. Like shirts. Like- right. It, at my college, they even had a cafe, a little coffee shop. It was called the Shea Cafe. And oh, it was wow. after Che Guevara, you know, and I would go there. And they and have no idea what he's responsible no for. No idea what he did. And, mm-hmm. and so people would like jump on that or you know, wear a sickle and hammer t-shirt thinking, right. oh, right. it's kind of edgy and cool, not knowing how evil it was. Right. <laughs> you know, and then this one is, what I liked about the video is the, a guy went to these college campuses, spoke to these people about all the protests that have been going on lately, and asked them questions directly about what they are talking about themselves and how much they know about it. And as he's talking to them, he puts their name and how much they pay per year for college. <laughs> so it'll be like, Kimberly, <laughs> you know $48,000 a year. Right. Uh Mark, you know, 70, $71,000 a year. And listen to how educated they are. And this is what about their what they're school out here protesting. Has not told them about. Right. And right. I, and I for some reason it it made me like laugh while shaking my head. Yeah. It's kind of like a DUIQ kind of thing, right? Kind of, yeah. In a way. In, yeah. in a way. Yeah. Uh, all right, here, here we go. Welcome to Gaza graduation. Let's see how much students actually know what they stand for. If you get them right, you win $100. First question, have you guys chanted from the river to the sea? Yes. Okay, which river, which sea? The sea of... <laughs> So you don't know, you don't know. Uh, no. And the answer was the Mediterranean and the Jordan. All right. So yeah, you've heard people in these <laughs> protests. You hear that like, chant. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So what are you talking about? Which so, river? Which sea? I mean, if you're going to chant something, shouldn't you maybe yeah. know what yeah. you're chanting about? All right. What does Hamas say their number one goal is according to their charter? They just want to free Palestine. It's to murder all Jews around the world. How many years did Israel occupy Gaza? Late 1800s, the entire time. That's since 48. It was actually under Egyptian control for the oh, first wow. 20 or so years, and then Israel actually left Gaza in 2006. I'm shocked. Wait, they left? What does Antifada revolution mean? I don't know what that means. But you've chanted it? Yeah. <laughs> it's like a global call to murder Jews. Wow. Wow. Did you know you said that? No. Would you say it again? Probably not. How much have our foreign adversaries donated to American universities in the last decade? No idea. I couldn't give you a number on that. The answer was over six billion. How many <laughs> Gazan refugees have the Arab neighboring countries let in in the last few months? 35,000. The answer was zero. zero. Students don't seem to know what they stand for. So wouldn't it be great if these expensive colleges actually taught them something? <laughs> yeah, it'd be something. Yeah, there, yeah. there's an idea for yeah. you. Uh, yeah, it was right, just... but that doesn't come up in your liberal arts classes. Right, right. right. Yeah. So it was very eye-opening. It also made me think of my classes that I had. I took this one class called uh, Women in Media. Mm-hmm. And I thought, oh, this would be interesting. And there was, at the time, Madonna on the cover of a magazine. I think it was Vogue. And she's in a pool wearing pigtails and wearing pool floaties. Yeah. She's trying to look like a little kid in a pool. All right. This is Madonna. She kind of controls her own image, right? Right. And the teacher, the professor said that this was society's way of showing the world that women can't swim. Oh, really? Like, oh. Is so, that what that is meant? Is that oh. what that is? <laughs> huh. And then w- okay. she would show us billboards of ads for shampoo, for example. Yeah. And it showed a woman from b- behind with her long, flowing, clean, shiny hair because it was a billboard for, again, shampoo. shampoo. Right. And she said this billboard is proving to society that we compartmentalize and objectify women because we're only looking at their hair. Yep. Like, well, in this case, yeah, because, it, you know, on a kind of shampoo. shampoo. <laughs> right, yeah. Shampoo. Yeah. Now, if it was a t- like an ad for, like, tires for your car, <laughs> right. and it showed the yeah, tires, right. that'd be different. 
But yeah. I can see your argument. But, <laughs> right, you know, exactly. You know, shampoo. <laughs> Are you sure you didn't go to art college? <laughs> <laughs> what hippy dippy school yeah. did you go to, Greg? Yeah. <laughs> well, you guys ready for a dumbass contest? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Listeners, let's give you a chance to win some stuff. It's time to play the Craigslist Price is Right. Yeah. Rick. Craigslist Price is Right. I have uh, all these things that are being sold on Craigslist. Uh, the ads have been printed out. I'm going to tell everybody about one of the items, and I'm going to ask somebody here in the studio, who I think has a pretty good shot of giving us a decent bid on it, how much they think it's being sold for on Craigslist. You, as the contestant, just have to guess. Is the actual Craigslist price for that item higher or lower than the bid that was given here in the studio? And if you can do that correctly, you're going to be the winner. Noisy. All right. Hmm. I'm looking at a couple of the, uh, which one I want to go with first. And we're going to go to the phones, 877-44-WOODY. And let's say hello to Chris. Chris. Hello, Chris. What's good, Chris? Morning, Woody Show. Morning. All right, so we're playing the Craigslist Price is Right. And the first item here, we're going to ask Ravy yeah. about this one. Boo. Boo. Yeah. Boo. Yeah. Iowa Hawkeye Caitlin Clark Crunch Cereal. Oh, oh. She had her own cereal. Hard to find, Iowa made, Iowa Hawkeye Caitlin Clark Crunch Time Cereal. Collector's box. Unopened. Ooh. A great chance to win a signed basketball inside each Ooh. box. Oh. Price, like Ravy's lady, lady boner, is firm. <laughs> Get There's it. the, uh, that's what the box looks like right okay. there. Ravy, is she living up to the hype? Uh, she's doing well. Uh, her team has not won a game as of yet. Oh. But. Yeah, but it's just like, that's how. It's a, it works. It's like a transition you, from yeah, college to pros. The, yeah. the best player you get put on the worst team. Mm. True enough. True. <laughs> they still yeah. haven't quite found their way yeah. yet. I'm going to say 100 bucks for the cereal. First of all, box. 100 bucks. Is that what you said? Yes. Okay. Uh, higher or lower than 100 bucks, Chris? Uh, let's say lower. Lower. Actual Craigslist price, $40. Yeah, hey! oh! that's coming at you, Chris. There you go. All right, congratulations, Chris. You are a winner here on the Craigslist prices, right? Congratulations. Yeah. Nice. All right, one on, one win. Let's that, go to... That was uh, a low ball for that cereal. Yeah, Let's go to Mallory. Hey, good morning, Mallory. 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 Mallory, are you there? Oh, oh there she is. Yeah. Can you hear me? We can hear you. Great. Craigslist price is right. And since he was uh, complaining the loudest, I'm going to give Greg the next one. Yes. Oh, Don't see. reward Weak. him for his bad behavior. <laughs> that was normal Weak. behavior. All right. Uh, this is a wine bottle lamp. Okay. Oh, classic. So, uh, yeah. It says uh, put a small candle or tea light inside the top of this one of a kind lamp. Okay. And uh, let me show you what I'm it looks like. You can describe it to the oh, audience. Oh, God. <laughs> That is literally thing. just a wine bottle with the yeah. world's ugliest lampshade. Yeah. <laughs> that is maroon, has a Tassels. maroon like band around it, and then these, what would you even call those? Like beaded, yeah, like Persian yeah. tassels, Do- like doilies, yeah, things. That is hang. That is what is so it on the bottom? Oh, you know, it looks like two dudes about to make out on the bottle. Oh, because it's like this little like yeah. uh, cupid that's holding up a wine glass, and it looks right. like it looks like two dudes right. getting ready to make out over wine. So that's perfect, Greg. <laughs> Okay, yeah. It should yeah. Be. Yeah. Uh, yeah, look at that. Yeah. Let's say $25. $25, Mallory. Do you think the actual Craigslist price is higher or lower than $25? I'm going to go higher. Higher. All right. Well, the actual Craigslist price, and I'm going to tell you, Mallory, you are a winner because it is actually right on $25. What? Yeah. 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 And in, in the case we have an exact bid, the tie goes to the contestant. So, Mallory, congratulations. Awesome. Sweet. And the Yay, person who gave the Greg. exact bid Welcome. has to buy it. Oh, that's right. Mm, so give that to Greg <laughs> so he can uh, purchase it. Mallory, hang on. We will get all of your information. Let's go to our next contestant. Let's say hello to Opie. Good morning, Opie. 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 Good morning, guys. How's it going? We're doing great. All right. Craigslist price is right. Next item up for bid. And uh, who just did all the Kentucky Derby stuff? Sammy. Yes. She went to a Kentucky Derby party. Oh. Remember? Dressed uh, up and all. I was going right. to say, my brother went to. No, no. There was somebody in this room, and it was gotcha. Sammy. I got that right. I got yeah, that right. I, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It was my family. All right. So this is a Kentucky Derby hat. 
Mm. Ooh, okay. Says this hat is ready for your next Kentucky Derby party. Nice. Really stunning in person. I bet. You will love it. All right, check it out. Oh, it oh. is stunning. Wow. That oh, is wow. stunned. Looks like somebody took an entire flower bouquet. Oh, okay. Just, beautiful. Yeah. Now, are those feathers? real flowers? Okay. No, that's like they a giant. Um, I think there's black feathers on the end. Oh, on the end. Yeah. yeah I thought you meant that flowers. big white bloom. Yeah. yeah it's okay. definitely a flower. I don't, now, could this be real flowers or would these be like fake those ones? Because you want to be able so to wear it next keeps, year, right? Yeah. yeah. Right. True. Yeah. That is I mean, elaborate. I mean, she's got yeah. blonde hair too. She does. Would you, I... wear, would you rock that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know about that one. I don't think that. Uh, oh, too much? Me. Dude. Uh, or not the, enough. Well, the colors to me all seem to clash. I don't really know oh, what they were going thing? for. I, I don't you know what you know. would wear it with. I thought you didn't want to show off too much. <laughs> I will say $45. $45. Bucks. All right. Now, Opie, what do you think? Do you think this is uh, actually oh. higher or lower than the $45 bid that Sammy gave us? I think it'll be higher. Higher. Let it be higher. Yeah. Actual Craigslist price. Two hundred and fifty. Wow! Wow! Yeah. 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 Way to go, Opie! Prize coming at you. Thanks, guy. Yeah, dude. That is a uh, rip. That's a lot for that ugly ass hat. Ooh, that was, is very expensive. I was yeah, watching I mean, this show called, I think it's called Buying Beverly Hills. Yeah. Menace, yeah. you know that Kyle yeah. Umansky guy. Yeah. They have a vacation home. I think it was in the fancy part of where all the celebrities go. I can't remember the Hamptons where. Hamptons? No, like the mountainous type place where. Oh. Uh, like not, Boulder? Not, oh, no. Not you're Jackson Park Hole. City. Uh, not Park City, not Jackson right, Hole. Anyway, Mark, it doesn't anyway, matter. Aspen, Aspen, Aspen. Aspen, Aspen. Oh, okay. Aspen. And they went to this cowboy hat store. Mm-hmm. The ha- oh, cowboy yeah, the hats. hats were thousands yes. of dollars. Yeah. yeah. I yeah. would have thought 50 bucks. Yeah. No. Not thousands. the nice ones. And no. don't even get started yeah, on not the, the cool ones. Yeah, right. not the nice cowboy hats. <laughs> but those cowboy hats are nice. This hat looked like she made it from things she found at Michael's. It looks like she. Wow. Jesus. Wow, 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 wow. That looking wow, ugly. Wow, yeah. wow. It's straight custom. Yeah. Uh, let's what say hi is. to Jesse. Good morning, Jesse. Hi, Jesse. Hey, good morning, you all. Good morning. We're playing the Craigslist Price is Right. Next up, we'll, uh, we'll throw one Menace's way here. Yes, finally. Uh, it's a Little Caesars 1980s oh. container. Oh, really? So it says container. Little Caesars Pizza Expandable Kool Aid Mixing Jug from the 1980s. No way. <laughs> what? Uh, yeah, so basically. They probably had a collaboration with Kool Aid. You know, like those collapsible, like yeah, you can yeah. Yeah. extend them out, yes. kind of. They're made of plastic, and mm-hmm. it's yeah. that. And you can mix your you can wow. mix your Kool Aid in there, Rave. Oh my god! So <laughs> it's it's all <laughs> white on the bottom. Right. It's got that like accordion like kind yeah. of uh, wow. the um, part in the middle. It's uh, got little Caesars on it. Man, wow! I miss the eighties. Yeah, like molded into the plastic, <laughs> and it's got a big red screw on top. It looks right. like a. Like a, like a, like a pill bottle. If you went to Costco, like maybe yeah. mayonnaise would come yeah. in something yeah. this yeah, yeah, yeah. this shape and size. But no, this is the uh, the Little Caesars 1980s container. How much do you think it's going for, Menace? Five dollars. Five dollars, Jesse. Jesse. Do you think the actual Craigslist price is higher or lower than five dollars? Uh, I think it's higher. Actual Craigslist price, ten dollars. Hey! Oh yeah. All right. Jesse. Dude, have we ever had all winners like this? We I, have. I think yeah. so. Yeah. yeah, yeah. We've crushed it before. Yeah. Wow. Just killing it today. Jesse, congratulations. Another winner. Nice. All right. Thank you. You're welcome on the Craigslist Price is Right. Do we have time for one more? Yeah. Yeah, if you want. Yeah. But if you yeah. want to blow the streak. Yeah. Do we take Do we take the chance? Let's yeah. take a chance. Oh. All right. All right. Okay. Leave it up to Greg. Pick a line one through ten, Gregory. Uh, seven. Line number seven. That would be uh, Mike. Hey, what's, what's up, up Mike? Mike? Mike. Mike. Hey, Good, Good morning, Woody. Good morning, Mike. Hey, <laughs> come on, you. All Welcome right, to so, the movie phone. Uh, <laughs> let's play the Craigslist Price is Right. Ravy. Oh, boy. Okay, Ravy. Look, oh boy. if I was bidding, I could also bid on this. Okay. I'm a fan. Yep. It's a Steelers handmade bar. Oh, Okay. So this guy made it himself. I have a one-of-a-kind, well-made bar. It's made it with treated lumber, so it could be used indoors or outdoors. It's got a big old Steelers logo right mm-hmm. there in the middle of it, black base. It's got like a little uh, gold band that kind of goes along the front edge of the bar top, which is then just a regular stained, you know, like a stained, uh, like a, okay. what do you call it, like a... 
like a oh, golden, like, like a like a golden maple kind of yeah. yeah, yeah, top That's color there. Cool. Good so it's black I mean, it looks pretty maple. good. I was yeah. expecting something more. It said it would be great to put in a man cave or by the pool or wherever you could think of. Mm. Yeah. So how much for this Steelers handmade bar? I'm gonna say. Yeah, that's all right. A hundred and twenty-five dollars. Hundred and twenty-five bucks, Mike. What do you think? Actual Craigslist price, higher or lower? Higher. Higher. Does the shriek continue? Actual Craigslist price, four hundred and fifty dollars. Oh wow! Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. yeah dream on, seller. Oh. Mike. Yeah, congratulations, Mike. Yeah, they're keeping wow. the streak alive. You know. You know. You know. Yeah. <laughs> you yeah, want me to pass this over to you? You can buy it. Uh, Take it. a looky. Uh... I wish I liked it more than I do. Wow. <laughs> I remember when you used to be a fan. I, yeah, I am too. a fan. Yeah. All right, more Woody shows next. Hang on. Sit tight. More next. The Woody Show.